Hi everyone, I'm Dragon with you. So today we will talk about an event which is about ranking actually. So just a warning, this video is basically a warning that we have winter tail which requires you to do some casual stuff like login, spend emeralds, open artifact chests, spend energy, chest and adventures, parches, parches which can increase your chances in ranking. And here we go. So that's what I wanted to talk about. Take position or higher in the gift center ranking, first of all. And you need just to jump there. So you need to jump into top 30, top 5, top 1st, if possible, and get rewards. You can get it during 5 days. So maybe it's not the best day for you today, but the faster you do it, the better probably you will get. And same here, so take position in ranking of receiving gifts. Unfortunately, my guild supports me pretty high, so I can get top position in gift receiver, but I can't get the sender because I didn't pay too much into this game. Okay, so let's talk about ways to proceed in this. So first of all, basic holiday every day is probably the best way because as you can see i try to clean it up every day so i give one gift of each type to each my guildmate and that's how i collected already 34 so that's not so bad sometimes i didn't send skin gift because i already own all of them and i don't need more but other gifts i try to send one type every day another important thing is actually buffing the previous video was about polaris and i really tried to improve her so at least i plan to get her into five stars as for my teams i don't plan to play her for now but still it's a great chance to invest and get back so not sure i can upgrade her to orange plus three because I calculated the investment and return rate and I guess I will not be able to collect the necessary artifacts during the days which remain. So five days, not sure I can do it. About red, so obviously not because I don't have so many artifacts. But that provides you a great boost in ranking. After that, uh, I guess that was um, power of elements which I maxed. And upgrade skin so i went all in into her skin and as you can see i'm still not there so just look carefully the amount of skin you can afford so for me for example i will probably go for 48 skin because i can do it and that's the way the event can help me as well you have time of the fearless which brings you extra skins Complete quests as usual. So reach artifact level after 100. We need to use the red parts, which were introduced pretty recently. That means you either invest into Polaris to get more rewards, or you invest into main team. So I chose my main team because I still need to fight all the way through, and that's why I focused on main team, but 100 level is okay. After that, ability level. So ability level is the easiest part, but for some reason I forget about it all the time. So just make sure you visit Polaris often and improve your abilities before you get mask. I don't think that it's complicated and it boosts you very hard. And finally, glyph level. So I stop at a point, check the amount of resources I have. And the approach is pretty simple, so I try to go equal level for each glyph. And uh, after I reach, for example, 25, I switch into another glyph and start it. So that's the basic idea, how you invest the lowest possible value and get rewarded for that. So actually, final thing, our actual ranking, yes, and look at that. So present sent. Just compare the amount of generosity points which I own by completing events and which our tops on server, so that are the probably heroes of this game who really want to get elemental spirit totems. Look at that. 
So even the lowest of them invested times more than you, right? So check your ranking. If it is possible to jump into top 30, do it. If not, well, maybe you need X for sale. Maybe you just need to do it today and forget about that later. So as you wish. Present received. My guild is loyal, so they help me a lot. That's the reason why I'm in top 30. Only because of my guild. Great thanks to all who are part of this. So we have three representatives here and that's all. About the decorating tree, our guild is force in decoration. I prefer to decorate my titans instead of tree actually with emeralds. And that's the reason why probably you can do same stuff. So obviously you can decorate the tree using emeralds. We have emerald sale now. So special emerald sale. And as you can see, I didn't do anything here. That's the reason probably why I don't decorate it too high. But still, save resources till next time. Give gifts to your guildmates, maybe accept skins. And uh, that's how you can rank up. Okay, so good luck in this event.